Welcome to the Intarso TCR20 Target Retrieval System Setup video. In this tutorial, we will go through 5 easy steps on how to install your TCR20 target system. Once you have unpacked the target system, you will find the following parts. The drive unit, wall mount, target support and the target holder, guide ropes, target ropes and target buffers, bullet trap, power supply, and the setup guide that you can also use as a template for precise drilling. To install the target system, you will need the following tools. A Phillips screwdriver, measuring tape, drill, and an 8mm wrench, ratchet or standard. Now we are ready to start the installation. Take the drive unit and the screws to the shooter's table where you would like to install the device. Align the template to the edge of the table and drill the mounting holes. Insert the screws and screw them in. Use the bullet trap to ensure the screws are screwed in to the proper height. The bullet trap should be able to just slide under the head of the screws. To finish this step, just place the drive unit on the screws and slide it into place. First, take the wall mount and target support. Screw the target support onto the wall mount until the screws are tight. Next, go to the wall where you'd like to install the wall mount. Mark two points 129 centimeters above the floor, approximately 16 centimeters from each other, and connect them by using a ruler. Do not worry about the precision of the distance between the points. Our drilling template will help you to drill the correct distance. Place the template on the wall so the lines you just marked matches with the drilling template's lines. Use the hand drill to drill the holes marked on the template. Remove the template and fix the anchors into the holes. The type of anchor will depend on the type of wall you are mounting to. At last, screw the wall mount to the wall. Take the white guide rope and target buffers and go to the wall mount. Take one end of the rope and add two target buffers to it. Once the target buffers are on, insert the rope into the wall mount as shown. Once the rope is in, add the remaining two target buffers and pull the ropes to the drive unit. Finish this step, put target buffers on the other end of the rope and tighten them into the rope holders. Take the target rope and the target holder. Put the rope around the wheel in the drive unit and pull it through. Insert the rope into the hook as shown. Then attach the hook to the target holder. Insert the rope around the pulley on the wall mount and connect the hook to the target holder. For the final step, let's install the bullet catcher. Just take the bullet catcher and place it into the wall mount. In the end, Plug in the drive unit. Once powered on, the target holder will always return to the home location. Place the target in the target holder and you are almost ready to start your training. The first time you start your device, you will need to perform the automatic calibration. Just hold both buttons of the drive unit for 10 seconds and the target will do the calibration ride to measure the correct distance. Now you are ready to start your training.